chromatography. This method was discovered by a botanist, Swett, in 1906. It is a modern, versatile and widespread technique. This method is based on the principle of selective adsorption of the components of a mixture. It is the selective distribution of the components of a mixture between the two phases, moving phase and stationary phase. Normally, the two phases used in a column chromatography are liquid as a moving phase and solid as a stationary phase. The column is filled with a paste of solid stationary phase like aluminum oxide or silica. A mixture to be separated is poured from the top. An eluent moving phase is added from the top as it moves. The different components are adsorbed on different parts of the column. Depending upon the physical state of moving phase, the chromatographic methods are named. For example, gas chromatography, thin layer chromatography, paper chromatography, etc. The method is very useful for purification of the elements which are found in tresses. The absorbed components are removed separately by adding an eluent moving phase from the top that is a suitable solvent. The mobile phase may be gas or liquid. A component which is more soluble in a moving phase gets adsorbed later and the one which is less soluble gets adsorbed first. The component adsorbed later is deadsorbed first. Column chromatography is used when impurities and the element to be purified have less difference in their chemical properties.